guys here for another video as you can see i'm wearing somewhat of an indian weird shirt honestly i was watching i don't know if you guys watch fresh and fit but they did an interview with ziz's brother and i'm like oh shit there's like a video there's there's like the infamous blue shirt video that he rocks and there's another video of a blue shirt where he's rocking this shirt and i was inspired to wear this i'm obviously not as buff as him but it's your boy's training. It's your boy's trying to be a special agent FBI. I've been doing my workouts. I could do 80 push-ups without stopping. I could do a seven-minute mile. But it's just I ain't, and you know the arms ain't that big. I can't do that many pull-ups to be honest. But it's your boy's working that for those are you know starting the new year and they don't know what to do. Trust me, go to the gym. Get start you know get started working out. It's hard at first, but trust me, going every day for 30 minutes and then eventually working up to an hour is going to be healthy. And if you can be in the best shape you can uh, be, you will get some bitches naturally. Trust me, a girl likes a guy that can take care of themselves and it will take you very far. So that being said, we're going to look at someone named Step Mommy, Z Mama Zay, Step Mama Zay, Zayla Step Mama. Obviously, it was a request. I regret getting this request because of... Uh, Typically what I like to do is not only do they have a big Instagram following, but they have some other forms of social media so people can kind of um, find leaks, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and she does have leaks, but I'm just saying I just like to have people that have like a TikTok, a YouTube, an Instagram, a Twitter, kind of like the whole package so I can show you guys who I'm talking about. You guys can kind of see how they promote themselves and then you guys can kind of make the decision from there if you do want to get their OnlyFans or not. Again, that's why this video exists, but I just like to uh, see, you know, influencers, so to say, or models that have more profiles than just their Instagram. Like I mentioned earlier, this was a request. Gonna talk a little bit of shit and then just dive right into the OnlyFans. So she does have an Instagram, 155k followers. Right, and get it. This is just who you need. All my socials, which is just one. Uh, I, I shouldn't have gotten her. I don't know. Obviously, I did get it because it's a request, but I'm looking at her and something seems off about her. It seems like, I don't know about you guys. For me, I think she has cancer. I'm looking at her hair. It feels like this is one of those things like when you get chemo and you're like, man, I really need some hair. Where can I get some? This would be the wig that you would get when you get fucking chemo. Stage five, you're gonna die. You only have a year left. Bitch, I gotta capitalize on my OnlyFans at, uh, before I die type of thing. I don't know. That's the vibe I got. Typical white girl, nice tits. I get it. Some people are into the whole fake tits, fake body type thing. I'm not too into that. She's kind of attractive, but like I said, when I see her, all I think about is cancer, chemo, breast cancer, fucking all this menopause type shit, and I ain't trying to think about that at this time. Now, she does have Twitter. Not too active on that. You definitely want to see some pictures of it. Uh, and I will say, this is one of those people where you do want to just Google her, right? You would be surprised how many answers Google has, right? If you want to know how to dispose of a body, Google can help you. If you want to know how to kidnap someone, Google can help you. If you want to know how to do Calc 2 Basic Integrals, Calc 3, or maybe 4D Dimensions, or maybe orthogonal bullshit, or other types of complex things, whether it's math, rape, kidnap, drugs, cocaine prostitutes or just leaks definitely google's there to help you shout out to ask jeeves you guys are young enough to do that but she does have a lot of leaks online and i will say uh leaks are kind of a double-edged sword what do i mean by that if let's just say you look at leaks of her right and you see her just sucking cock slurping this shit getting fucked donkey style 50 billion cocks in her fucking ass she's holding she's fucking paradactyl and all this shit and then you see all those leaks and you're like okay that's interesting all of her leaks are triple x all of her leaks are very rate r all of her leaks are her sucking some sort of cock therefore i have a pretty good assumption that maybe her only fans is like that uh and this is like what i mean by a double jawed sword in this case it's not and that all the leaks that you do find online are a lot of pay-per-view stuff so i don't do pay-per-view stuff because i try to keep everything on the budget obviously if i spent hundreds of dollars and thousands of dollars i'm bound to get some good content eventually but i only review the base up because most people objectively speaking only get the base up and try not to spend too much money so if that's said, let's just get right to the only fence so right when you get it, it says making you horny making you smile are my two favorite things to do i don't know about the smiling part i highly doubt anyone gets their only fans to be like wow you made my day and for those that do do that you guys need to get your life reevaluated. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm not the most perfect being. I, I can, I'm a fuck up when I, you know, fuck things up. I'm trying to be a better man every day, every year, so, you know, I can get the best partner and future that I want. But don't ever say that your only fans makes me, makes my life better, makes me smile. That looks very desperate. She does not respect you. She will only see you as a cash cow. And to continue, it says, you better prepare yourself for one wild ride, baby. 
And, you know, I saw that. I'm like, okay, cool. We're talking Splash Mountain, Space Mountain, Disney. Uh, let's go to Universal Studios. I'm ready for a wild ride. Let's see what the fuck this bitch has. And, unfortunately, there ain't much of a wild ride. This felt more like Kitty Land. This felt more like the rides where you have to be at least two feet to fucking enter, a.k.a. not fun at all. Now, for the pricing, I did get it for three bucks. It normally is thirty dollars. Thirty dollars is a lot. Hence, I always say I usually wait for requests until they go on sale. Right? I'm on a budget. I'm not trying to spend more than a thousand dollars on OnlyFans. I think I've already spent in total over ten thousand dollars. I think I don't know if I add everything up. It has to be at least ten thousand dollars. But it is three dollars on sale. So uh, I always say if it's more than fifteen bucks, then they better treat it like a fucking job. And that's not to say if they pay less than that, they shouldn't. It's just that there is such a thing, in my opinion, as like a premium subscription or you pay uh, a certain baseline right to get xyz and if you pay a lot more then you probably expect to see a lot more but in her case there isn't much of an expectation like i said she did say get ready for a wild ride trust me they ain't no this ain't no wild ride this is literally a stroll down fucking walmart now for the description, again, pretty bad, doesn't tell me what we're getting, right? BG content, GG content, uh, fingering, solo, tell us what you're doing with your body, because otherwise, I don't know what it is, right? Ideally, normally, I don't think it's too far of a reach to say I would like a description that describes what your product is, describes what your service is, right? I don't think that's too far of a reach, and I always find it fascinating that these OnlyFans girls can't compute, like, basic logic. I, it just blows my mind, but hey, that's what it means to be a hot woman these days, right? As Myron always says in Fresh and Fit, only stupid pretty girls are allowed to be stupid, right? They can get what they want with just their looks. Now, for the photos, there's 1,777 pictures. Not much of an impact, right? I always say cool pictures at awesome if you see her tits 20 times 200 times it does lose some value it just isn't really much worth it now i get it you guys are probably wondering do i get to see some nipple do i get to see some pussy do i get to see anything crazy now i did look through most of the pictures and i saw a lot of instagram like pictures i did not see any nipple i did not see any arby's combo meal number five roast beef pussy i did not see any pepperoni type nipples it's kind of weird how female body parts are associated with ham and meats but hey if you're expecting to see that type of shit you're not seeing that in the base sub with the pictures now for the videos there is 110 videos the longest video is get ready guys shout out to work ethic 30 second videos are 36 seconds 29 seconds 29 seconds 29 29 24 24 and the majority of her videos fall between the 4 to 15 second mark shout out to work ethic i say that with sarcasm by the way um pretty horrible like i mentioned earlier the description doesn't tell us much and i get it if you guys are wondering is she getting fucked am i seeing her suck a dick am i seeing her finger herself without an underwear or tri triple x content or any type of that content that you do see in the leaks you're not seeing that in the base sub i will warn you guys if you guys like twerking content if you guys like video content that's very tiktok like if you guys like video content where she literally grabs the camera posts for her tits for a couple seconds does a little cute fucking pose and then smiles and then the video ends if that's what you like then cool you can admire that but i definitely think if you want nut material this ain't the place to be. Literally, this feels like I'm in a fucking Scholastic Bowl school fair trying to, like, looking through the books, right? I had to literally watch her OnlyFans videos about three times because it just wasn't memorable. I have really good attention span, but when I was watching her shit, I'm just like, Ugh. like, I just couldn't compute how, like, it was just so fucking boring. It's like those history videos that you get in your high school and then you're, like, watching how Abraham Lincoln fucking made, like, a, I don't know, a piece of bread and you're just like, oh my god, it can't get any more boring. That's her only fans felt so like i mentioned if you guys are expecting to see nut material triple x content uh or anything crazy you're not seeing that it's just a lot of videos of her showing herself off doing a cute pose showing her butt off and that's it you do get to see some nipple in the videos uh you do get to see her fake tits in the video but like i mentioned earlier there isn't like her uh maybe shaking her boobs for like a minute long obviously her longest video is 30 seconds uh there isn't any of that kind of solo play that i think a lot of people would expect if you have a solo content type only fans uh again based off the leaks and assuming that they're all like it trust me her base sub is nothing like that and last but not least she does have some things in the dms uh i always say it's just not worth spending things in the dms but hey if you want to spend 11:47 for a 20 second video would you like to undress me then use your naughty tongue to explore my body I get it, it's a kink, I get it, it's naughty talk, but I don't think I've ever seen a dude undress a woman with her tongue. I mean, the tongue isn't that strong of a muscle. I can't 
imagine taking off a girl's bra with my tongue. I can't even imagine taking off like her underwear or her socks or anything with my tongue. So I don't know where she got that from. I, maybe she's dated guys with strong tongues. Shout out to that. Another three pictures for $9.99. Uh, another a minute and 41 second video for $18.99. Want me to start the fun? Let me tease you with my body to warm things up and make your cock hard and ready for me first. Uh, another video for 24 seconds, $10.99. I want to be your own toy that you can play with. I was made with your pleasure. Put your face on my tits, play with them and get me wet and i could keep going with these dns but again they're very overpriced 10 bucks 34 second videos my tit wants to feel your cock between them do you think you can help me i think it's to no surprise that her videos suck they're overpriced in my opinion please just stick with the leaks and i just don't really think as i always say you should invest in this person's dms if they're not willing to invest in the base sub so overall, her OnlyFans, pretty bad, garbage, basuda, trash, ain't worth it, save your three bucks, save your 30 bucks, it's just not worth it, stick with the leaks, and honestly, I always say this, women get away with not putting work ethic into OnlyFans because there's people that allow them to. I try not to, uh, you know, I don't want to review a shitty OnlyFans. It just so happens to be the case that most of these OnlyFans suck. The majority of people just don't know how to put work ethic. The majority of people, like, think about it. I work, what, 30 hours, 40 hours? There's people that work 50 hours, 60 hours. Like, there's people that work in McDonald's that work more than them. There's people that work, are surgeons that work more than them. It's normal to work hard. It's normal to have a baseline standard for work. And these OnlyFans girls, Instagram models, have the privilege of not doing that. And I definitely think it's shitty when they're charging 30 bucks for a subscription where they just don't put that much work into it. Like always, guys, please leave a comment below for any suggestions. I hope you guys like the Ziz shirt. This year is the year of lifting. Uh, I'm starting to lift again hopefully i can get swole because i used to what work four hours work out four hours a day when i did wrestling oh that was fun just fucking after school that was like my job i don't know lifting and all that stuff is always fun but like always guys please leave a comment below for any suggestions google form description i do take every single request please hit that like button i'm trying to get 50 trillion likes and 500 billion subscriptions uh and if i don't do that by the end of this year i will actually kill myself later